Pensioners have traveled from far and wide to attend this pensions welfare conference in Abuja, hoping to be informed about their rights and obligations on pension entitlements. For decades, accessing pension benefits has been a major challenge for many pensioners in Nigeria. The 2014 Pension Reform Act was brought in to address this and other challenges, including the non-payment of contributions by employers. Although Section 4 of the 2014 Pension Reform Act stipulates a 10% pension contribution from the employer and 8% from the employee, not all employers have complied with this provision. The challenges are still there and the funds are really not uh, uh, very forthcoming. When I first retired, there were some issues concerning government remitting the money. But as soon as it was remitted to them, I was called. But I discovered that there are some discrepancies, which we are sorting out now. The 2016 fourth quarter report by the National Bureau of Statistics reveals that only an estimated 7.4 million workers out of Nigeria's over 69 million working population are enrolled under the new pension scheme. Some pension experts are, however, optimistic that the new pension scheme will improve with time. If we are to compare with the past pension scheme, I think this one is better because many of them died without collecting anything. I know of my father-in-law, he was queuing here in Abuja, never collected anything. But myself, immediately I retired, within six months, I got the lump sum, though this other one is small, every month, 20th, we are getting our money. The new act has made it compulsory for every employee in the federal service, state, local government, and private sector. Do you understand? So it is more uh, uh, embracing more friendly, more, more contributors you know, friendly than the previous art. I know, I know the, the, the more and more amendments will continue to come as the scheme evolves. The scheme, the scheme is still evolving. It's about uh, 11 to 12 years old now. Although the plight of pensioners have improved to some extent since the Pension Reform Act, there's still much more to do, and not only regarding better access to entitlement, but some experts are also calling for stiffer penalties and better enforcement. Currently, the punishment for conviction of mismanagement of pension funds is a fine or up to 10 years imprisonment.